is up, Trainters? Ludo here, back with another fabulous video of Pokemon Go, and today, Palkia raids are here in Pokemon Go, as announced yesterday, and if you don't know, Palkia is the brand new Tier 5 legendary raid boss from the Sinnoh region. Along with it comes multiple videos on the internet of Palkia raid guides, but the one I think you need to check out, besides this one obviously, Masterful27. Check him out. Uh, we're doing a little race to 1K here, so uh, if you're part of the Fab Fam, you should definitely go check out Masterful27. He's in the UK. He's a great guy. He does good videos. He's very informative, and he uploads pretty frequently. So go check him out. Give him a sub. Slap him a like. Tell him the Fab Fam is here, and of course, be sure to hit that notification bell icon on his channel as well. But let's get into our power. Palkia Raid Guide. Palkia and Dialga are the two, uh, kind of the two main legendaries of the Sinnoh region and the uh, Diamond and Pearl games. Dialga is my personal favorite, but I'm not worried that Palkia came first because that just means next will be Dialga. Well, one would think. Niantic doesn't always do things that make sense. Anyways, the brand new legendary spatial Pokemon Palkia is now here in Legendary Raids. So we're gonna sit here and go over some of it and hopefully I've got a raid back there about to hatch and I'm hoping people show up so we can get that Pokedex entry, which for the original game reads, it has the ability to distort space it is described as a deity in Sinnoh region mythology. And other Pokedex entries read a legendary Pokemon of Sinnoh. It is said that space becomes more stable with Palkia's every breath. And it is said to live in the gap in the spatial dimension parallel to ours. It appears in mythology. Don't get it twisted, it ain't a mythical. It just appears in mythology. The legendary Pokemon Palkia is a dual-typed water and dragon Pokemon with a max CP of 3991. And when it comes to the meta, it will arguably be one of the best dragon type attackers and second in place with attack stats. As for its water part, Goodbye Kyogre, it is now the best water type attacker. So it's packing some heat, it's got great dragon type moves and great water moves, so it's a good Pokemon to have in your arsenal. Speaking of moves, the possible moves that it can have for its fast moves are Dragon Breath or Dragon Tail. For its charge moves, you're gonna see Draco Meter, Hydro Pump, or Fire Blast. Now with that, when you are encountering a Palkia, you are gonna want to get a Fire Blast in the sense that that's gonna be the best one to go against because that's the worst move for it to have. But in sense of what you want, you want Draco Meter. That will be an Annihilator for Palkia to have, so it, it's really up to you. If you're trying to do like a duo, you probably want to encounter a Fire Blast one in some kind of weather boosted condition for you, so that way it might make it actually a lot easier for you to do. Or if you're really wanting that good challenge and that good move, you're of course going to want to encounter a Draco Meter one. And when you encounter it, the CP you are looking for in non-boosted conditions is 2280. That will give you a 100% level 20 legendary. If it's weather boosted, you're going to be looking for 2850, and that will give you a level 25 perfect legendary Palkia. So for that, you're going to want to look for windy and or rainy weather. As for battling the legendary Pokemon Palkia, it takes super effective damage from dragon and fairy type moves, but on the flip side, it is resistant to steel and double resistant to fire and water. Of course, as Palkia being a dragon type itself, it's effective against other dragon types, and as a water type, it is effective against ground, rock, and fire. So realistically, you're gonna need about three to five good high-level trainers with good good powered up and good moved Pokemon. Other than that, you're gonna be looking for around a group of six to 20 other trainers. So 
be sure to get out there. Uh, it is past one o'clock as I am speaking. So as I said, I'm really hoping that one, that that's not some kind of weird egg and it, you know, was like right before one o'clock and that it is a Palkia. And then, then I'm hoping that people actually show up because unfortunately not a lot of people actually show up to the raid back here, even if it is a new one. But the team you're going to want to use to take down this Palkia, it's pretty simple. Your dragon types with dragon type moves. So first up, Rayquaza is going to be your best bet against Palkia with Stab, Double Dragon move sets, Dragonite, of course, with Double Dragon move sets, and then Palkia itself with uh, the Dragon move sets. And then a little lower on the line, you got Salamence and Latios. So both, again, all Dragon moves, uh, Stab, Dragon type attackers, and when it comes to the Fairy type attackers, all you really have is Gardevoir and Togekiss with Dazzling Gleam, of course. So, if you have a like 100% Gardevoir that is like 100% maxed out, sure, definitely throw that in. It might actually fare very well. But again, if you don't have any of those, there's a good list. You have Executor, Gyarados, Latias, Groudon, Mewtwo, Flygon, Kingdra, and Giratina. Again, with all of these having majority dragon type moves besides uh, Mewtwo with, uh, I believe it's Confusion and Psycho Cut. So make sure you assemble a good team. I will provide down below the link where I got all of my information from, from PokemonGoHub.net. So make sure you go down there, check out what you need specifically, unless you are living somewhere where you just know you're gonna have 20 people in a lobby and you're not worried. But either way, it's here. Palkia is here. I'm really glad that we have a brand new, brand new, not recycled, brand new legendary out and about. It would be really cool, would be really cool if for the first time that it's out, it also had shiny as well. That would be so, 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 so cool. So either way, we're gonna hope that people show up back there or that we can go out not too far and find one and do one at least for this to show you guys and get that in the decks. So, wherever it is, we'll see you at a Palkia raid. <sighs> okay, so we are at our Palkia raid. We've got a small, good little group. Um, I'm actually gonna use those two up front as suggested, but I'm gonna change the rest of them. Yep, right there. So, that is a good enough team, I think. Uh, I, I, we're expected to at least faint once, uh, probably, so, but here we go. Okay, 10 balls. What is, what do we got? I forgot, I already forgot what 
max CP was. 22.25. He looks so weird. Like when I played the handhelds, I did not expect him to look like this. This is a little strange looking. <laughs> okay, let's get the obligatory A, uh, the obligatory AR. Okay, I don't need any more ARs than that. Okay, 22, 25. We're gonna try and get it with a silver pineapple. He's really far, so this is gonna be really difficult to gauge it. Oh, he's not, he's not too far, actually. Okay, can we get our first? Ooh, no, that was a horrible, horrible, horrible throw. So is that. Okay, we are we need to not mess around. Okay, that was okay. I may need to put the camera down. Oh, that was a bad throw. Okay, I need to put a I need to put this down. Okay, okay. Okay, that's right. We already buried him. Okay. I'm already nervous. This is only five balls left. He's really, okay, excellent throw, but they don't like those. Okay, he's not that actually bad to throw at, okay. I think I can get this on these last four. I don't want to get an excellent throw. I hate getting excellent throws, because I don't feel like you ever get it on an excellent throw. <sighs> come on, come on. Let's go to Raz, let's go to Raz. Come on, come on. I want you in my decks, please. Well, that was well, that was a great throw. It's not too bad. I thought that was going to be a little too far and high. Oh, you! Oh, you! Oh, you! Oh. Yes! 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 Dude, okay, he does look a little better now that he's up close. I think there's a problem with his size. I'm gonna say there's a problem with his size. He's supposed to be quite huge, so. I'm gonna say kind of like uh, with uh, Riperior, uh, how his size was kind of messed up at first. I'm gonna say that his size is messed up. So, Draco Meter and Dragon Breath. Best moveset, sweet, to praise it. Strong, bummer, okay, but still, attack. But whatever, I don't care. We got our registration Palkia in the decks. Super exciting, I'm happy with that. First day, first catch. And I think that's where we're gonna end this. So please scroll down, give me that like. You know you wanna give me the like for the brand new registration of the legendary Palkia. Also, maybe consider subscribing if you're not. And if you are subscribed, be sure to hit the notification button next to the subscription button so that way you're notified of the next adventure. And we'll see you then, trainters. Stay fabulous. Bye.